And you might have seen a few new signs popping up across major intersections in Midland. They look a lot like this. Say no to panhandling. Yeah, that's what they're about. The city, they put them up to discourage people from giving money to panhandlers. Instead, they're encouraging those people to donate that money to local charities. How do you feel about those signs? Jonathan Palasik spoke to a few Midlanders to find out. Say no to panhandling. Contribute to the solution. Give to local charities. You might have seen these signs popping up across Midland. The city of Midland has no official policy on the legality of panhandling, which has led some people to question why the city put these signs up in the first place. When I see a sign or hear about a sign like that, um, you know, I just kind of think about what are, what are the motivations for it? Um, you know, what's the goal for the sign? Are we just trying to get people off the corner? Um, are we trying to actually divert money to local charities or kind of what, what, what's the purpose for it? Eccles doesn't see the sign as a solution to the problem. I understand that the need to address things and to, um, to try to do something about any issues about people getting blocked or harassed in any kind of way. Um, yeah, I just, I, I'm not quite sure that a sign is the answer to that. However, some Midlanders like Jessica Papula think these signs are beneficial and will help the city look better and create a safer environment. But I think it's a good idea and I think it's good for our community and it's good for our city, you know, to, to not have people in the street, not only because it doesn't look good, but for their health and safety, you know. And while these signs could potentially be considered controversial, Papula hopes that people see these signs as a good thing to help make the city secure. I hope people take it positive instead of bringing negativity about it because it's not just for us as uh, a community like that have our homes or where we live. It's for everyone, for them that are begging in the street. We spoke with the city earlier today. They tell us the main reasons for putting up these signs is because they've received numerous calls about the number of panhandlers at major intersections, and they hope these signs deter panhandling. In Midland, Jonathan Palasik, News West 9.